Okay. We're here. Um, give me one second, everybody. The one day things would go wrong, of course they do, because <laughs> because it's me. Um, there we go. Now we got sound. Part of my delay, uh, uh, starting tonight. So many problems. I know I always say this, but streaming is never easy. If you want to do it right, it's never easy. But, um... Yeah, we're gonna play some Jackbox games. Um... Uh, looks like it's just me. Maybe everyone's on their way. So... I'm gonna wait a bit. Uh, uh We'll see what happens. Um... Worst comes to worst. There's always more loop here, but... Let's give everyone, where's my Ron Burgundy news team, assemble! <laughs> um, so yeah, so we're going to be jumping in, we're going to be playing Jackbox 1 through 7. Oh, which reminds me, I have this cool little... Uh, okay, let me see. Hey, Abyssal Lich. How you doing? Uh -uh. Sorry I didn't have a, uh, a morning stream today. Oh, I had a long day. Damn meeting, and then I had to help clean up my house because <laughs> we had visitors. Uh -uh. But, um, God. I'm ready to just relax for a bit. <laughs> so we're playing Jackbox. I don't know if you've ever played Jackbox before, but, um... If you got a tablet, another phone, maybe you can play without any of those just by watching the stream. Um, it's pretty cool. They're fun. Muglord, yeah, uh, suggested I do it for the Rona anniversary. We're one year and two days, four days, I believe. So, um. Hopefully tonight will be uh, uh, some good old-fashioned fun, but um, let me see. I'm going to move me just ever so slightly. Eh. There we go. Sorry. <laughs> um, okay. There we go. Hopefully, the game isn't like Omega level loud. <laughs> but, this is Jackbox. Um, hopefully, there's not any lag, too. I know there was a bunch of lag last time, so let me. <laughs> he also missed tonight. Oh, I think yes. Sorry. I think I I got like your message way, 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 way too late. <laughs> You're not the only one I missed, though. Something... I don't know what it was about today, but everyone's like, was calling me, looking for me. And then I was like, today was just not the day. <laughs> I wish it was, but today was not the day. So let's see. Uh, you don't know Jack 2015, Fibbage? Let's see. Pull your friends with your lies. Avoid theirs and find the usually outrageous truth. The mayor of Rabbit Hash, Kentucky is a. Oh, this is a good one.
Cool. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to try to do this. Um, my game code is on the screen. Cool. I'm in. I don't know if anyone else is in. <laughs> Okay, let's see if I can do this. I might have a thing I can do. Um... Let's see. Oh, okay. Pipitch doesn't have an audience. Oh, it's only for the audience. Oh, there's only so many games. Okay. Well, that was worth a shot, I guess. Um, <clears throat> yeah, like I said, uh, let's... Wait and see if anyone's going to join. Uh, uh. It's kind of on me. I really should have prepped. Well, not prepped, but... Give a little forewarning. Could have sworn I did, but... When you're up... <clears throat> at the crack of dawn... And you're just like, so little sleep, <laughs> so little sleep. Anticlimactic. Climactic? God, I can't even speak. It's how tired I am. A little anticlimactic if I play by myself, but uh, let's see. Are these all let me see two to eight? Okay, here we go. I can start off playing that. You know what? Let's just play. You don't know Jack. We'll start with this. Game has been activated. Okay, cool. Uh, single player, I guess, for okay, now. Okay, we are on. Uh, Cookie, we found your pants. Well, hello. It's about time. No, what, what, what should I do with this barrel? I see one like a bee. Hey, that looks like me. I was about to say, wait, are all these people in? Ah, oh, we got up. Wow, how many episodes are there? Wow, there's a lot. Okay. Uh, spin. Really? 
can I even... Uh, don't you hate going to the movies by yourself? I mean, I do. We have so much in common. I mean, oh, maybe you and I should sometimes... I mean, I don't know. I mean, I, whatever. I guess there aren't any good movies showing right now anyway, so... Never mind. Forget I said anything. That was stupid. <laughs> this is... Flavor Die Drops it is. I am Cookie Masterson, and I shaved my nipples for this, so let's hurry before it grows back. Like, we need to get moving now. Playing alone, I see. What else is new? And today's wrong answer of the game is being brought to you by... Flavored Eye Drops. Why let your mouth have all the fun? Flavored Eye Drops. Pick the wrong answer associated with our sponsor to win a fabulous prize and big cash. Cool. All right, let's get this party started. Get ready, time for fashion. Run. Let's start with Eat, Pray, Die. Which of these Julia Roberts characters would Jack the Ripper have been most likely to savagely murder? Aaron Brockovich, Vivian Ward, Tess Ocean, or Liz Gilbert? Uh, nah. <laughs> Next time, try this. Vivian Ward is the name of the prostitute Julia Roberts plays in Pretty Woman, and almost all of serial killer Jack the Ripper's alleged victims were female prostitutes, so he'd probably have just loved to murder her. Ah. I can see it now. He now I the see. box with his knife in it. She'd reach in and he'd playfully shut it, snapping her fingers. She'd laugh, he'd laugh, and he'd kill her. Let's try, if I only had a brain trust. Suppose the Scarecrow from The Wizard of Oz faced off against the Wicked Witch of the West in a public debate. If he wanted to use a straw man argument against her, what might he do? Attack the Wicked Witch's character rather than the issues? Misrepresent the Wicked Witch's position on the issues? Prove the Wicked Witch wrong using statistical data? Or interrupt the Wicked Witch before she finishes her... Hey, remember when the Scarecrow says the sum of the square roots of any two sides of an isosceles triangle is equal to the square root of the remaining side? Yeah, he was actually wrong. So you guys have that in common. <laughs> remember when the Scarecrow says the sum of the square roots of any two sides of an isosceles triangle is equal to the square root of the remaining side? Yeah, he was actually wrong. So you guys have that in common. <laughs> Here's what Did it you just meant repeat itself twice? A straw man argument purposefully misrepresents an opponent's position in order to strike it down. Here's how I would debate the Wicked Witch. Ladies and gentlemen, one of the two candidates you see here tonight is a Wicked Witch. Thank you, I yield the rest of my <laughs> time. Dance with me, Disco 3. Ooh. Open wide for... Getting naughty, and this dissertat legs being tied up. Dissertat. I'm gonna read off seven names, and for each one, you tell me if it's the name of a necktie knot or the name of a sex position recommended by Women's Health magazine. If it's a <laughs> necktie knot, press the square button. If it's right, this a should sex be good. position, press the circle button. Alrighty then, here it comes. The half Windsor. The valedictorian. <laughs> yeah. The Prince Albert. Uh. The Trinity. The Caboose. The Chairman. Damn it. The Foreign Hand. Yeah. You wear clip ons, don't you? We need to fact check those. We need to fact check those right now. My usual sex position is also the way I usually tie a tie. The alone caboose. In front of a mirror. Next up, shop till everyone drops. Say at Christmas time, every single item at your local mall sells out. According to a popular grim fairy tale, which of these stores has the best chance to be magically stocked overnight by hardworking elves? Footlocker, Radio Shack, Victoria's Secret, or Lens... Huh? <laughs> it's so obvious. In the grim fairy tale, The Elves and the Cobbler, a poor shoemaker is given some much-needed help by elves ah. who appear in the middle of the night. 
And while the shoemaker made a nice profit, the elves were trampled to death on Black Friday. <laughs> And on its way, Okia Dokia. If you're driving between company headquarters, which trip should be the shortest? Ikea to Kia, Kia to Nokia, Nokia to Ikea, or Ikea Nokia and Kia headquarters? Good effort. Good effort. <laughs> Where's that confounded right answer? Nokia is based in Finland, and Ikea is based right next door in Sweden. Kia is based in South Korea. Finland. Whether it's phones, furniture, or cars, if it's got Kia in the name, you know it's gonna be cheap. I mean inexpensive. Inexpensive! <laughs> We've finished round one, and I'm happy to report you have the best score. Remember, in round two, every question is worth double. Okay, we're bringing it on. Buck her up for... Muscle milk was a bad choice. Say the news team from the Anchorman films decides to run a relay race against a rival news team. If Ron Burgundy is his team's anchor, when will he run? Before Brick, Brian, and Champ? After Brick and Brian, but before Champ? Before Brian and Champ, but after Brick? Or after Brick, Brian, and Champ? In a relay race, the anchor, usually the fastest runner, goes last. Yeah. And they would probably promote the race so incessantly that by the time it actually took place, you wouldn't be that interested in seeing it anymore. I got the answer right because I was thinking about beer times. <laughs> Here's a good one. Guess who's Dak? Dak again. You know, I'm not an optimist, but I have to say, I feel like things have been going pretty well with the game so far. Send daddy for data out me. Oh no, my old ventriloquist puppet, Billy O'Brien. One's made of skin, one's made of wood, so who's the dummy? Not me. Billy, the whole creative team here decided to not include you in this game because you're too much of a troublemaker. Troublemaker? Me? No, I just got back from traveling the world, studying all the profound teachings of titular world spiritual leaders. Yep, that's a troublemaker. For instance, which titular religious group was found to die someone with the last name of Smith? Protestants, Episcopalians, Trustitarians, or North? Nuts. Can't do anything right, can you? <laughs> Want to see Damn. the answer? The Mormon religion was founded in the 1800s by Joseph Smith. In America. So, which was your favorite religion you studied? Well, Interesting. I particularly like the ones that treat the doubt reincarnation. Someday, I hope to come back as a beautiful coffee table. Ocho. Here's one I like to call Orca's Eleven. Say I wanted to go around freeing the killer whales from every SeaWorld location in the world. How many separate rescue missions would I need to go on? Three rescue missions, four rescue missions, five rescue missions. four. Did you pick this on porpoise? <laughs> Damn these guns. It was begging to be picked. There are three sea worlds, one in San Diego, one in San Antonio, and one in Orlando. So you would need to go on three separate rescue missions. Well, that sounds like a lot of traveling. Maybe I'll just pay that shot. kid from Free Willy to do it. Something tells me he could use the cash. May I introduce Kangaroo, Peanuts, Albert Einstein, or Uranus? <laughs> the name of Jeff Dunham's purple skinned puppet Kangaroo, Peanuts, Albert Einstein, or Uranus. His name is Peanut. Got that one. Finally. I have to admit, people who talk through ventriloquist puppets kind of creep me out. That you talk through me. Quiet, Billy. Stop trying to get me to kill people. Wow. Now you're creeping me out, man.
I call this one the midnight run to the bathroom. According to Henry Wadsworth Longfellow, how would Paul Revere secretly signal to you that he has to pee in the sea? I have to do a number one in a one. I have to do a number one in a two. I have to do a number one. Maybe. <laughs> Allow me. According to Henry Wadsworth Longfellow's poem, Paul Revere's hmm. Ride, Paul's signal for the British was one if by land, two if by sea. And as we all know, a number one is a P. And Americans would have known about the British sooner if he hadn't stopped for a number four. You don't even want to know what that is. I don't. I really don't. Oh, God. Welcome to the attack. When you see two clues that match, press the X button. 2,000 big ones if you're right, but if you're wrong, you lose 2,000. And most importantly, remember the clue. It's gotta be a match that fits this clue. This plus this equals that. What new thing do these this combine This plus make? this equals that. that. Alright. Offer. Red and white. Oh God, I'm panicking. <laughs> Put in chloride and sugar, salt. Bison and cows, Care Bear. Cowlick? No. I spun. Damn it. Basketball? Oh, damn it. No! People? That's a thing? Diet Coke and Mentos. Minotaur! Salt! Oh god! Eruption. Steve Rogers and Super Soldier Serum. Captain America. I don't know. Bink. There we go. Champagne and orange juice. I'm pretty sure that was a screwdriver. Bink. Oh, there we go. Mimosa. Falling in black lights. Falling in Jack and Coke. Ah! Salt, 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 salt. Tiger. Yeah. Cosmic bully. Okay. There you have it. It's important what you add together. For example, I crossed a wolverine with a baboon and wound up with what I'm calling a wolverine. Don't worry, I brought a strong lock to the cage. I have it right here in my hand. <laughs> and that was that. Stop, stop it! You don't know Jack! I really didn't. I truly didn't know. <laughs> Okay. Let's see. Is there anything else I can do? Looks like the night is slow. Um Nice water. Let's try that. Howdy, and welcome to Lie Swatter, the massive true or false trivia game. We can accommodate a huge number of players in a game. Just trust us, we totally can. Ah, this one, you know what, this one will probably use. Let me see. Did I have my name? 
Let's tree of let's God, I can't talk. Let's tree. Let's see if the thingamabob that I have will work. Um Okay, A L O V. Ah, no audience feature. Okay. Fourth shot. Um. Well, looks like it's just me again. So, bam. I am ready to play. All right then, before we get started, don't forget, new players can go to this website and enter this room code to join the game at any time. Let's begin. You're going to see seven crazy facts pulled from these fact categories. A man in South Dakota built a guest house using only AOL CDs. Use your device to pick whether you think the fact is true or a lie. Damn. I wanted that the to be true. The largest catfish ever caught weighed over three tons. Three tons? No. Okay. It's way too big for a catfish. Hunter S. Thompson appeared in a She's so tiny. Drugs video. Hunter S. Thompson appeared in the... Uh, sure? Truth? John Bon Jovi had his wedding vows renewed inside the Oval Office. That sounds like something he'd do. Truth. Or not. Bubblegum is pink because that was the only color dye the inventor had at the time. That's a lie. Oh, never mind. It was the only food. Ah, oh, okay. A Brad Pitt ad was banned in Malaysia for potentially making locals feel inferior. <laughs> That's gotta be true. <laughs> Called it. It makes people feel inferior in the US too. <laughs> There's a dead person on the moon. No. Is there? What the hell? Ooh! An astronomer had his ashes. Ah, oh, okay. And here's your score at the end of round one. 200. Respectable. Here are your next seven fact categories. Chicken nuggets! The Moulin Rouge now houses a TGI Fridays. <laughs> Bees produce colored honey after eating M&Ms. That's gotta be a lie. Wow. Blue honey. Green honey, you get the idea? Oh, okay. Jamie Lee Curtis okay. speaks four languages, including Klingon. Oh, please let this be true. Wow. Damn. I wanted to believe. VW Beetles are not classified as automobiles in Canada. I don't know. True? Something about Canada. Wow. Damn. Hasselhoff won the rights to the catchphrase Don't Hassle the Hoff in his divorce. <laughs> Please let this be true. True, true, true. Don't hassle the half. Yes! He owns that. Even a divorce can't hassle the half. <laughs> Swanson released a line of chicken nuggets shaped like historical figures. Yeah, why not? Anything can be a chicken nugget. Aww. 
We still have dino nuggies. Newt Gingrich's first wife was his high school math teacher. With the brain that big? Yeah, I believe it. Called it. <laughs> they multiplied. Again, not overly impressive, but I'm trying. For the final round, all the facts will be about one category. That category is international names. Can you figure out which of these facts about international names are really lies? In Sweden, Friends is called Pod of Dependency. Oh, uh, um... I'm beginning to realize this is hardly Japan, ever Chuck true. Cheese is called House of Electronic Rat Pizza. Oh, please. For the love of God. Damn. It's just Chuck E. Cheese. In Brazil, Target is called Bo e Quiver. Nah. In Australia, Burger King is called Hungry Jacks. Maybe? Where's Lozo when you need him? Oh, cool. I got that one right, Lozo. Burger King wasn't already trademarked. Ah, interesting. In India, Walmart is called Best Price Modern Wholesale. <laughs> nah, I couldn't. Could it? Damn. Keeping the name short and sweet. Oh, yeah. In Germany, Mr. Clean is called Meister Proper. Oh, he better be. He better be. Yeah. How do I join? Oh, okay. Um. In Italy, Mr. Bubble is called Tony Bathtub. Who the hell is Mr. Bubble? Sure, he's called Tony Bathtub. And Abyssal Lich. To join me, go to... Hold on. Here's your final score. Wow, how the hell? I don't know. I got some, right? Um, okay, cool. So go to... Um, hold on, maybe it'll show the website. Jackboxgame.tv? Let me see. It should say... We can play a two-player one. Um... Let's see. Okay. There we go. Go to jackbox.tv. I was going to say like .com or something. Yeah, so just go to that website and enter in your the room code, which is HPAD, HPAD, and your name, and then you should be uh, good to go. As long as you have the stream up, you'll be able to follow along. The website is just for the answers, so. I'll give you a couple minutes. Uh, I, I may have to do a, uh, <laughs> a redo of tonight. Or maybe have Jackbox at the end of the month, which is next week. No, which is in two weeks. <laughs> Nice. All right, cool. All right. Hi, I'm your host.
host, Cookie, and this game will be broadcast in 112 languages. You'll just be seeing the English version, though. <laughs> Two players it is, and here I am, yapping. Let's do this. May the best liar win. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for fooling your opponent with your lie. And you'll get 1,000 <laughs> for finding the truth. Select a category. Ooh, what do we got? Peak, sixth grade, homecoming. Okay, Damn, auto here's your repair. First question. <laughs> it's time for a road trip. While in Florence, New Jersey, be sure to check out the auto repair shop, which, according to its owner, has an operational toilet once owned by blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool your opponent into thinking it's true. If you can't think of anything in time, use the lie for me button for half the points. Do it now. <laughs> do it now. Do it. Um. Hmm. We shall see. Hurry up. Use a suggestion <laughs> if you can't think of anything. Okay, there are your choices. <laughs> Find the truth Damn. and answer it on your device by touching the answer you want. King Tut's toilet. His own toilet bowl. An operational toilet once owned by Hitler, Kurt Cobain, James Earl Jones. Damn. <laughs> ah, damn. Damn it. Uh... Okay, what did everyone pick? Damn, I wanted to choose that one. Hey. And that's it. Nobody else's lives got picked. So Hitler's toilet is like a thing. <laughs> All right, pick a category. Oh, okay. Uh... Okay, here's the question. In October of 2013, eight sixth graders from a New York college prep school were hospitalized after someone released blank in a classroom. Enter your lies now. Hmm. Hurry! Hit the lie for me button if you can't think of something. Could be interesting. All right, where's the truth? Hmm. Up to someone released hummingbirds, Ebola, Axe body spray, mosquito. Okay. 2013. Was Ebola even around in 2013? <laughs> I don't know. Help me. Pick something. Oh God! Panics. I right, panics. Who picked what? Damn. <laughs> well, don't was... you feel foolish? <laughs> what? Most likely from being instantly dogpiled by dozens of supermodels. The and likeliest of scenarios. Up there. Axe body spray put six, put eight sixth graders into the hospital. Shaking my head. <laughs> Time to pick a category. Uh, the ball's in your court. Oh. Okay, here's the question. On December 3rd, 2009 and March 30th, 2010, rapper Eminem tweeted a photo proving he was surprisingly really good at blank. Type in your lies now.
Hmm. Hurry up! Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. This one could be very interesting. <laughs> Okay, which one's the truth? Ooh. Chess, sewing, basketball, or Donkey Kong? Damn. He's surprisingly really good at it. Huh. I don't doubt that he could do any one of these things. Um... Alright, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> nice. And that means... Good job, Whistlelich. Ah, oh, chess was the lie. I was gonna choose that one, too. This is round two, which means all point values are doubled. Exciting. All right, pick a category. All right, my turn again. All right. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Coca-Cola it is. the question. Coca-Cola once commissioned a video game from Atari called Pepsi Blank. Enter your lies now. Huh. Interesting. Coca-Cola once commissioned a video game from Atari called Pepsi. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. <laughs> Pepsi trash. <laughs> Pepsi spies, Pepsi invaders, Pepsi versus Cola. Hmm. Okay, let's take a look. I gotcha. <laughs> nice. And I got it. Two and for two. The, rest of the board goes unselected. Select a category. Oh, I get to go again? Uh... It's not hard. You know what? We'll just stick with this one. Eddie Murphy. Okay, here's the question. Actor Eddie Murphy released a dance song in 1982 titled Boogie in Blank. Type in your lies now. Eddie Murphy. Brother of Charlie Murphy. Hurry up. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Once played basketball with Prince and then afterwards ate pancakes. After he lost. <laughs> okay, here are your choices. <laughs> Boogie in your butt. Boogie in LA. Boogie in the new year. Boogie in my heart. <laughs> Damn. Um Damn it. I'm torn. Ah. Let's see what everybody Please selected. let it be your butt. Oh, wow. Well, you guys blew it. <laughs> it was boogie in your butt. And nobody fell for this one. Oh. I'm not even mad. <laughs> I wanted to choose it, and I panicked. Time to pick a category. Happily, ashes... Pattern. No, 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 that's okay. I've got it. 
knows it is. Mohammed Kursid Hussein is in the Guinness Book of World Records because he is able to blank very quickly with his nose. Enter your lies now. Is it snort the crack? <laughs> is he the person that can do that the fastest? <laughs> uh, the hell can he do? Hurry, hit the lie for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, here you go. Find <laughs> the truth. Muhammad Khrushchev Hussein is the Guinness Book, the Guinness Book of World Records. Uh, uh, it's in the Guinness Book of World Records because he's able to do blow very quickly with his nose. <laughs> Type very quickly with his nose. Shoot milk or eat spaghetti. It's got, it's got to be one of these. Okay. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> He's the fastest nose typer. Good He's job. probably the slowest at making friends, though. And we're done. <laughs> Do blow with the nose. This is the final fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Good luck. Okay, here is your final fibbage question. Brand name of the patented synthetic testicles for pets. Type in your lies now. Hmm. The brand and name of the patented synthetic testicles for pets. I'm just shocked that they Use make synthetic testicles for pets. Alright, where's the truth? <laughs> the nonads. The nudicles. <laughs> Steel balls. Testies. God damn. Which one is it? <laughs> Um, okay. Okay, let's take a look. <laughs> you got me good, Abyssal Lynch. <gasps> and look what we have here. Nudicles. <laughs> a cheaper option is to just not cut your dog's testicles off. And look at oh, what we man. have left. One Steel single balls. lonely pitiful lie. <laughs> I really wanted it to be that one. Alright. So that was Fibbage. Um, let's see. Let's jump into another game, Abyssal Lich. Let's see. Uh, this might be fun. Oh yeah, this is... This one'll be good. Word spud. Okay. So, same thing. Just, uh, you should still be on the website. Just enter the new code. DTHZ, and then, uh, you'll be in. Deal with the devil. Otherwise, you don't. When a word floats towards you, type a word or phrase that relates to it. Devil's food cake. That's exactly what I was thinking of. Alright. This will be good.
Ooh, okay, so you just have to finish the word. Smart anything. Anything to just... Uh, uh... Dead meme. Hey, dead meme! Smart ass. Oh, I forgot to vote! That was a good one! Run for your life. Oh. Yeah, that's a good one. Well done, life. Life. Uh. Life. Life coach. That's a thing. No. <laughs> okay, and that's a good one. Well played again. Damn it. Parking. <laughs> that's hard. I might have been. I might have been. Oh, damn. Ignition. Damn it. <laughs> what the hell am I supposed to do with this? Ignition. Ah, uh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Nope. I'm just, just gonna die a slow and painful death. Ah, I got nothing. Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> good luck, Abyssal Lich. Ooh. Yeah, that's good. You got my vote. Back here. <laughs> Oh, okay, drops, um, rubber... Damn! I'm just gonna steal it, rubber duck. <laughs> Free! It died on me. Ah, oh, no problem. Feel free to jump back in. If you can. Uh, the coach should still be on the screen, so... Oh, damn it. Uh, I'm gonna steal yours, Ignition. <laughs> That's the only thing. I think I spelled it wrong, too. Because I panicked. stuff. I don't know of anything that could possibly... Doormat. Finally. Redemption! <laughs> Ted talk. Oh, that was good. I like it. Damn. Talk. Talking. Okay. Whatever. I was gonna actually go with that. Gotta be something else. Talk. Talk. 
talkative. Ooh, that's... Yeah, that's that's a hard one. Didn't mean to do that to you. <laughs> I'm just trying to stay afloat. Slow death. <laughs> oh. All right, what you got, Bissellich? What you got? <laughs> Nightwalker. <laughs> I like it. And to be completely honest, that's what I was hoping you were going to write. <laughs> like, 100%. Walker... Walker... Man? Ooh, Walker, Texas Ranger. That would have been good. Total. Oh, <laughs> oh damn. Total me. I like it. We got my vote. Damn it! <laughs> Mayhem. Mayhem. What the hell am I supposed to do with that? Fine. Mayhem and madness. Good job, Abyssal Lich. Damn. <clears throat> That's pretty good. Good job, everybody. All right. Next round. Abyssal Lich, you're a beast at this game. Well, this this particular one. Ooh, sister-in-law. That was a yeah. You got the vote for me. <laughs> what I call my left and right. Law and order, baby. <laughs> order. Order of the fin. Not what the hell? What's a phenox? <laughs> um, end game. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. No. Yeah. I gotta give it to you. Game over. Well played. Um... Oh, that was weird. Oh, okay. Hmm. Dead meme, I think your internet is... cutting out a lot. I apologize for you missing some points. To you, Pistolage. Checkers. That was good. Yep. That's all good. Urs. Why is it so low? Urs. 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 Oh, Ursula. That's a name. Hopefully you can come into the next round, Dead Meme. Uh -uh. 
I do plan to do a redo of my Jackbox night. I was a little late due to some technical errors and uh, a lot of my community members that were supposed to be able to join um, missed for various reasons, so uh, I'm planning to do it again at the end of the month. Worm. Uh. Worm. I don't know. Worm husk? Is that a thing? Ooh, thank you. Husk. Husky? Yeah, I'll give it to you. That was good. I gave you. I gave you that. Ah, oh, sh. Wait. Eyes. <laughs> it's, uh, I gotta give it to you. <laughs> oh, yeah, I can go. I can do whatever I want with this one. Evermore. Oh, damn. <laughs> you can do something with Vermore. <laughs> you are the king. <laughs> I'm... Vermore? I don't know. I'll give it to you. T. Test. Hi, Chiba Nightfeather. Feel free to uh, join in the games. We're having a low key Jackbox stream night um, at the stream tonight. Uh, I'll be here for uh, about a couple hours more. Oh, damn it, forgot to vote. Either way, Bissolich just clobbered me. But, um, welcome to the stream. <clears throat> if you'd like to join in, I can do a new game. That looks like we have some viewers. So, feel free to join. Room code is EWWV. 